So in this video I'll be covering the calibration procedure on the Zimper MP7000 scanner scale. To enter calibration mode it can be a little bit tricky so you'll have to pay close attention and to do so you're going to be entering the top two buttons holding them simultaneously for five seconds. You'll hear a beep tone, you'll release it and then quickly tap the same two buttons again which are the zero button and the volume button within two seconds. If you wait too long it won't confirm and go into calibration mode and the confirmation once you're in it is a five tone sequence. So we'll go ahead and run through that process real quickly. Hold it for five seconds. Get the tone, quickly tap it. And there's the five second beep. That's indicating that you are in calibration. You should be seeing Cal on the seven segment display or if you have the post display connected, you'll see that. So at this point you want to calibrate at zero so we have no wait. Tap the zero button. Now it'll be prompting to calibrate at 25 with C25 on that display. So we go ahead and put 25 pounds of weight in the center of the platter. Stack that. We'll let it settle for a second, then hit the zero button. All right, they accepted that with the tone. We'll go ahead and pull the weights back off. And now it wants to recalibrate at zero. And once it's done, you should get a three-tone sequence. And there's your three-tone sequence. The unit will go ahead and reboot when this is complete. And once the reboot happens, the unit's ready to go. The reboot's happening here. There's a confirmation boot back sequence, and the green light solid and the zero light solid, and that indicates a successful uh, calibration. Now, to get the information for the PNC count, for the programming count, calibration count, you would just hold the zero button in, and that information will be rotating on the seven segment display, and we have a video showing exactly how to do that to, as well. You'll see the little display up here in the corner that's blinking. So. You just hold that continuously, the zero button, and it will cycle through a P count, C count, and scale firmware version. And that's it. That's all there is to the calibration procedure. Thanks.